Hey there everybody, welcome to another day of a vlog for you people. Uh, so today, if you've seen the yesterday YouTube video, well, the video, so yesterday was Friday, today is... Saturday, 2014, or 14th. Yeah. Yep, today at 14th, it's February 2015. Uh, so, yeah, so I got two points to the power supply and the Wi Fi corn. Um, so I unboxed those and uh, I decide to uh, test out a uh, power supply, so uh, what I'm gonna do is point the camera and uh, explain it uh, for you people. So uh, uh, let's take a look at <laughs> the power supply. Well, take a look what I'm testing with. Uh, so yeah, let's take a look. All right. So um, as you can see, this is. The Dell. Now I'm not starting a project with Dell. I'm just doing it for a test testing profit purpose. Uh, so that's what I'm doing. The doing the testing purpose. Uh, so that's all I'm going to do. Uh, so last night I blew up the camera. Just walk. Uh, so the next thing is uh, load testing. Now this camera is not going to draw very much wattage uh, it, because everything is on the CPU so graphics side and the processing side it's all on the CPU as you can see we have no graphic card uh, the graphic card is going to be built into the CPU uh, so we do have a big sick mechanical horn drive uh, we do have a DVD drive, um, so, uh, yeah, so, uh, what we're going to do, so what we're going to do is turn on the monitor, turn on, and say no signal, so that's good, and I'm going to reach the power button, and this is going to be so loud, uh, this funny thing about this is with this power supply does get a little louder it does get a little louder with this one so I'm pretty sure you can hear it <laughs> through the microphone so all right let's fire up Be starting while the machine have booted. I'm only hearing a humming noise from the fan. I don't want to sing, so. Uh, so today I'm going to whip a DVD. And while whipping the DVD, um. Now, generally, when you whip a DVD and encode them into, like, MP4 formats, uh, there is a lot of, uh, pro intense processing power to encode DVDs, uh, for sure. So, we put that off to the side. We did need to log in to account. Uh, log in. Not me. Okay, log in. Pass on. I only maintain this Camille, so. And two.
Okay, I call it unloading. I will try on call it unloading. So we take a look at hardware monitor. So oh, you hardware monitor. There we go. So we are doing pretty good with voltage wise. So let's make a little more expansion. So what I'm gonna do is hide it and we're gonna start up handbrake uh to whip the DVDs. So that what we all gonna do. See here, sometimes you have to go, go, oh, there we go, okay. Okay, there we go. Uh, video. Same as source. And we want universal. This is going to be a very tough setting. Frame rate, same as source. <laughs> Alright, so let's pop in the DVD. Don't forget there was a review video of Handwick. Where are the damn button? Where are your button? There we go. There we go. There you are. Button. See if this will work. No. Go to my computer because that button for some reason doesn't walk. Uh, open for no. Time scanning. Okay. So DVD drive. We have activity. Uh, there's no math actual name. Well, off the bat, you have to closely look at. Is it stick or does say it, it was designed by Peshiba and Samsung? Hmm. Storage technology, okay. Yeah, we're all 
fucking out pretty good, actually. Yeah, so this is gonna be uh, a boring process. So, I gotta find the correct chapter for this CD, which this DVD drive is a slow book when you use, like, VRC Media Player for, for example. So, it does take a little bit longer. But, oddly enough, this is moving along pretty good. Let's say, I would say this Dale Camille is loving that power supply so much. And, <sighs> so, okay, pause the camera. Because I don't think you want to stay at this forever. And, uh, I'm not going to do the boring process for you people, so. Uh, once I hit the start, well, once I get everything set up, I can hit start. And while I'm hitting start, I can show you the process. So this is where I bring up Task Manager and look at the CP load and uh, see how it work. Basically, well, see how, see how it work. So that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, as you can see, handbrake. Uh, don't forget, there was a setup video for say uh, for ripping DVDs, so don't think it's a simple click and install and you're gonna rip DVD right off the bat. You definitely need to put some uh, component, uh, or I should say script file on this program to get get that uh, <coughs> DVD ripping option uh, going for you. So, uh, like I said, let's stop. I should say pause. Okay, so I just got going and right off the bat you can see the CPU is pending to 100% two cores. Uh, like I said, this processor is a dual core Pentium processor, so it only have two. So as you can see, uh, two cores maxing out. As you can see, it uh, dipped a little bit, so. But if we take a look at hardware uh, monitor, move this guy a little bit off to the side a bit. As you can see. This can this pinion process, so it's not sweating too much. Uh, surprisingly, as you can see, we're doing good on RAM, doing very good. Uh, so, yeah, doing pretty, pretty good actually. So, yeah, that uh, with a DVD and uh, and uh, see how the power supply goes. Uh, like I said, this processor it's not gonna draw too much, so it's 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 not a uh, not the extreme processor on those high draw processor. It's not like I said, there's no video called with this. Everything is being run by the CPU. So yeah, so we're not. I'm pretty sure we're not pointing like. Or fully load on it yet? I'm pretty sure. So, uh, yeah. So we're doing uh, pretty good. And feel free to Google search uh, that. If you want to, you can knock yourself out with it. Uh, so, yeah. so as you can see, we're not using. This one, we are not. We are using this one. Uh, basically, we're just making sure this power supply from New Egg is doing uh, good or not. So, 
If I appear my computer, I do have a confident that when I hit the power switch, it will uh, walk. At least. At least walk. Uh, so. Uh -huh. Yeah. So. Yeah, it so look like we all doing pretty good. And I would say the only thing that's a light annoyance is the um, the buzzy noise uh, from the the power supply fan. It kind of sounds very odd. I'm not sure if this Google camera is going to pick it up or not, so. Maybe not. Maybe I put it up close. Oh no. Pretty sure they wouldn't have hit the microphone, so. <laughs> but I hope I found a correct angle uh, to. Uh, so you can hear it, people. Hope so. <laughs> so. That only complaint I have is that little fan. Kinda sound weird. Uh, another thing too, it does like to make a high pitchy noise uh, when the computer is off, but um, last night I only had uh, the whole drive connected and the motherboard. Uh, that was it, so. But since I had the optical drive to it, it kind of mellowed it out a bit, so. If I had more hardware, I believe that that's uh, that high pitching noise will um, will go away. So, but the only thing is a little bit head scratching for me is uh, is the fan on the power supply. So, uh, and the thing about that too is it shouldn't make that because it. See Sonic and the fan should be not making any buzzy noise. Uh, so, but I'm not gay. Be iffy about it. So, oh well. So, this process will take a while. Uh, so I'm just gonna pause the camera and next clip will be uh, uh, seeing how it do without no smoke. So, okay, pause the camera. Okay, so it got done with being the DVDs uh, for good uh, for good minutes. I shouldn't say minutes, but it took a while, or so. Uh, I shouldn't say that, but, uh, we got the DVDs, uh, with being tested, and the power supply is, uh, got done, and surprisingly cold. No hard air, it's somewhat feel, somewhat warm, but somewhat, so, not too badly. Uh, so we haven't stressed out too much yet, so, but a good way to test out, uh, because I don't have the motherboard yet, so, uh, this is the only computer that, or only testing computer that I can test this power supply, see if it, see if it work or not, uh, to ma double check, to make sure, so. Uh, it look like everything is 
running happily in the computer. Uh, so what I'm going to do next thinking is uh, uh, test out the Wi-Fi cord. Well, uh, make sure it's, it's talking at least. Uh, that's why I want. That's all I want to see is, is it going to talk to the computer or not? That's all I'm looking for, actually, so I should be able to uh, <laughs> see if it's uh, working or not, so pretty much that's what I'm going to do. Uh, but uh, I'm going to shut down and uh, drain the power, make sure that no power to the slot, I don't need to have it uh, arc, arc it, and uh, when it arc, I don't need a dead cord, so pretty much that what I'm going to do, shut down uh, actually I can hit shut down Shut down from the task manager. There we go. And yes, I'm still using Windows XP, but like I said, it's gonna go away. What the fan is on now? And that does kind of make a pinchy noise, too. And, uh, oh, man. So it does kind of make a weird kind of pitchy noise. So, but I hope that when I'm, I hope uh, when I get the motherboard, that it won't make that pitchy noise. So, let's drain the power. And I gotta double check the connection on this too. But you know, it's in there. Uh, so L L D is off. Okay, so power got drained. I need to go to the bathroom. But uh, once I get uh, done with bathroom, I can grab the Wi-Fi card and uh, see how this is gonna work out. Uh, so should be fine <laughs> for the, the quick testing purpose so I'm gonna be uh, back so I'm gonna pause the camera and uh, you will see me uh, back okay so we got the TP link uh, uh, Wi-Fi corn uh, so that's what you see in front of you so uh, let's Move this up to the side for a moment. You stay. I should be able to flip that up. And this is going to be interesting. Uh, so I might have to remove the antennas. So I'm trying to slide out the packaging. Turn it out of the way without breaking on me. Okay. This one excellent. Put that down. 
This is going to be a very interesting process. I bump it. I bump it. Okay, so I'm having a little bit of trouble with this, so I'm not going to the, pause the camera and once I get in the solder, I can show you. Okay, so I had to remove uh, the bracket to get in there. Uh, I don't have time to get the loophole fire bracket. I just want to make sure this cord is talking at least. That's all I want to see. So I got slime in there. Got the tinnitus on there too. So, um, so I did a quick test. See if, uh, see if it will. Uh, walk or not, so Poop poop poop. Okay, so I turn on the power supply I'll put that down There we go So I'll turn on the switch on the power supply Okay And the turn on the computer. Okay, boot screen came up. Okay, when the speed came up, so the corn did not causing no issues. So that is a good sign not causing no conflict um, which I don't need no conflict so I uh, did doing a very quick check over did a very quick one at least a quick check over or a once over Now I'm pretty sure like, well, there's no support for Windows XP, but Windows XP will tell us never than less it's they are talking or not. Uh, so that, <laughs> uh, it's, it will tell us if it's talking or what, that's all I care for. I'm pretty sure Windows will try to load a uh, driver for this Wi-Fi corn. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's right now. It's installing that the the, the basic one. So I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get a pop-up window too. Hmm. <sighs> 
Do you want him still? Alright, well, let's look on the event. Okay, well, let me get a CD. Okay, so we got the CD. Okay, so it read it. Okay, so now we can go sort. Okay. And now it's adding the driver for it. can hit finish it's already used okay your new old well has been installed ready and it's talking already surprisingly if I click here oh wow it's surprisingly picking up Blinsky round well on that quick. Huh? If I double click, it's probably gonna ask for a password. Yeah, it's already asking for an, uh, a password already. Wow, well, it also need a what the heck con. Y P E K. Hmm. Oh, this is going to be fun as heck. <laughs> but uh, it's surprisingly picked up Linsky. It's all it's asking is... Uh, it's also coined for... Oh, a VP key. Yeah, this is going to be interesting as heck. <laughs> So, yeah, it surprisingly walks. It walks surprisingly. <laughs> yeah, if I didn't have the CD with me, this would be a pain in the butt, but... Well, I have the CD, so... Well, we should be done with the CD. Be done with it. Surprisingly, it walked. It surprisingly pick up the the list key. I'm not going to enter in the password. I did want to see if it walked. So surprisingly, it walked right off the bat. So, and I'm seeing a little bit of activity light with that card too. Now it's like asking for like a. Uh, Is it asking for that, um... <sighs> for a... Uh... W-E-P. Um... So, what I'm gonna do is search up what the heck Y-P-A-E is. Now, the instruction does explain that uh, a welder does have a, uh, a YPP key uh, button, but half time I'm used to other devices where you did select a network, you enter in the bathroom, and 
bring you all in, uh, surprisingly, so, uh, yeah, so, so I'm gonna do a little bit of research of what the heck is up with this, uh, the, just for curiosity, uh, but it's nice to see it walking, and I'm glad that it's seen, like, as all, uh, Wi-Fi, uh, as all Wi-Fi uh, people, I should say. So, um, like we got HP Office, which nobody haven't put the bloody password in. Um, home, someone look like have the password on there too. And somebody who's right next to me is uh, have unskilled, but. Uh, yeah, uh, that was surprisingly damn easy. Um, just having a little, uh, pop-up window of adding the hardware. Then having the CD with that too was, was pretty, pretty easy actually, so. Oh gosh, this is the, me uh, this does bring back memory of, um, Laptop with Windows XP. Oh gosh, this is bringing memories. So I'm the totally side for this, but I'm not gonna do this. I did want to see if it walk. Um, and surprisingly, it walk. Uh, if you have, if you have the CD with you. Uh, if you did go through the window, uh, hardware setup, if you have a CD, gosh, this was pretty easy for sure. That was easy as heck. Uh, wow. <laughs> okay, so if I do it on Windows 7, uh, this should be very easy with Windows 7, um, because if it was as simple as that, if this is same as Windows 7, then great. Then I don't have to worry about uh, the software. Uh, so, yeah, that was, God, that was easy. Uh, so, power supply, working awesome. Wi-Fi card, working awesome. And we do have LED, which I am side with this, so it did detect the Linsky well um, but, uh, as you can see, we surprisingly got two balls with that too, so it did pick up, uh, some other well so, but I don't have the antenna in the correct way, so, it's working out great, actually, so, what I'm gonna do is, uh, shut down the computer, uh, take out the Wi-Fi, put that back together, uh, put the Dell back together, uh, but nice thing is putting the Dell back together is I don't have to re-screw in the power supply, I can just plug stuff back in and the Dell should be, uh, up and running and flawless, uh, so, yeah, so it's working on the... Totally great. So, uh, what I'm gonna do is, what I'm gonna do now is uh, stop flopping my lip around, uh, and uh, shut down the camera and uh, put the stuff back where it was. Uh, so, uh, yeah. So, all right. So that was pretty easy, actually. Too very e too easy. Uh, it was too damn e <laughs> Was it? It was very easy. It wasn't too hard, but uh, yeah. So uh, yeah, I <laughs> splice overall good. So all right. So I just want to make a quick uh quick video for you people and see how this. Uh, this testing hardware is going for you people, or we'll see how it goes. Uh, and I try to film this journey with you people, so this is, this 
is this is a beginning journey of building a PC. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I'm kind of lost. <laughs> so, I will see you next time. So, uh, feel free to uh, subscribe or Google Plus me, uh, whichever they work for you on your uh, Google account. And, uh, feel free to like this video if you like this content. And, uh, feel free to ask questions too. That Feel free and ask question. Uh, you're welcome to ask question. And what the heck else? I need to do no. Um. Uh, and feel free to visit the link below the video. You will find many various uh, stuff too, so like email address um, for this particular channel and there's Amazon project too, so you're welcome to help out uh, with Amazon project uh, down the wish list so you can easily easily uh, do it if you want to if you want to knock yourself out, which I'm okay with I'd be surprised, so, but nevertheless, so, <sighs> Amazon project, and I, I'm on a couple of social websites too, such as Tech Syndicate and Linus Tech Tip Forum too, so, I am part of those form too, and what the heck else, what the heck else, so, I believe that's it, if that is so simple. So, I will catch you next time, people. See you later. Like I said before, this is Saturday. Uh, Saturday the 14th of February? Is it February? Yeah, February. So, February. And I will see you later. Catch you next time. Thank you.